Hello and welcome to another episode of Jace Windu vs. The World. I'm your host, Jason, and it is the end of the month, which means it's time to have an end of month showdown with Jeff Ross. AKA The World. Yes. They call him <laughs> The World. <laughs> Jeff The World Ross. <laughs> ba, ba, da, ba. Oh, you know where you're going, huh? No, no, I uh, was kind of zoning out because I was thinking about the John Cena theme. But I like Metro City Bay right. Area. Let's do it. Oh, boy. Oh, geez, who are you going to be? Zangie for Zangie. That's oh, a good man. question. Oh, I was talking to myself. I know. Uh, no, you know, no, I made a huge mistake. There, we go. there you go. <laughs> now, this is going to be a best of three situation. That's correct, sir. So, I need to think to myself now, do I start with Sakura? And in the case that I... If, if Sakura loses, you know, I can just I can just counterpick and go over to my buddy Bison. Or do I just go to, with Bison in the first place? Cause like this this end of month thing, it's all about rivalry. And for Street Fighter, the rivalry is Bison and, and the Geefster. First off, there is no counterpick to Zangief. That's true. Second, uh try it out. You know, try Sakura. You can change, no problem. Um and this rivalry isn't about Bison and Zangief. I, I okay, guess. Okay, it's about you and me watching Zangief's rivalry with every other character. <laughs> All right. But you know, I think for... I feel it. I feel the psycho power okay. today. So, let's go. Zangief's been warmed up for four hours. Mm. He hasn't blinked since 3 a.m. <laughs> oh, there he goes. I just did the level one suit, uh, right. right? The your regular first, one. Your first V trigger, because you haven't really gotten to try out Cossack Muscle that much. No, have you? not really. I do know how to use Cyclone Lariat. Exactly, Lariat. So, uh, it seems like Cossack Muscle is just like more damage, yeah. and apparently you can you can combo into it with more stuff. But okay. Before uh, before I talk more about my boy. Good luck, Jason. Good luck to you as well. The handshake, the handshake has had. Okay. You know, we've been playing a lot of DBZ lately, so like True. the pace of this, it almost feels alien at this point. You know, yeah. it's just, oh man, it's very, a lot slower. Like, but I don't want to say slow in a bad way. It's just, I don't know. I really do like the pacing of Street Fighter V. Yeah, it's not too slow, not too fast. Right. It's no, like, marble for oh, speed. Oh, right. It's no injustice for slowness. Um. Scurry, boy. Oh, boy. That's not what scurrying looks like. You know, it's been a while, and it has been a while. I'd just like to say to your viewers, this is sort of like what happens when you stop practicing Street Fighter V. <laughs> you get Bison or Zangie play like that, where you used to win handily, <laughs> and now you have to eke out those sliver wins. <laughs> just trash talking our boy Jason. Yeah, yeah, it. you could. I don't it's, mean it. It's all in the results, yeah, which we're gonna yeah, see. We'll find out. Ouch. Who grapples the grappler? <laughs> Mika on a Saturday night. That's a good point. Oh. Ooh, the cross up. I just kind of let the game set the direction for right. me there. And it picked for me. I like it. That did not grab. Interesting. Yeah. I should have armored. Okay. Ooh. That's a little less close. Yeah. It used to be I could just, like, <laughs> win with Zangief instantly. Now I have to <laughs> eke them out. <laughs> Sounds familiar. It does. Sounds like a... Alright. Sounds like a very smart man. <laughs> Here we go. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh. Armor for days. 
Oh boy. That was such a fool thing to do. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> You're a damned monster. <laughs> uh, that's the kind of behavior that gets a message sent to you after the match. Hey, Chase. Yeah? You have to train body more. I know. Alright, me too, though. <laughs> was, you know, skin of my teeth. Right. right. Uh. I tried to go for the grab, but I think you were still in like the recovery from the, the cyclone. Okay. Maybe, I don't know. I was, it was a little weird. It was. But it worked out for one of us. Exactly. Got it got us the W. Ooh, I had to duck. Good, uh, bait. My Psycho Crusher! The slide! Good grab. Oh, oh. I tried to Lariat, but I hit oh, the wrong end. Oh, sure. I still probably would have taken it. I mean, you slid in, mm -hmm. so I probably would have got tripped up anyway, but... Well, anyway. Alright. Here we go, here we go. The pressure is on! For real. Fight. Who will take home the coveted W? Oh, I missed the jump, or the jump in timing. Ooh, right in that soft spot yeah. on the skull. Some of it is... For some of us, it's softer than others. <laughs> <laughs> I would say Zangief's muscles are harder than his bones. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, possible. <sighs> Good tech. Honks. You remembered last time. I sure did. There goes my Psycho Orb. You notice that it didn't go anywhere near you. <laughs> like, it didn't, you know, Do hurt. Anything. Yeah, yeah. I have to say, I noticed... Ugh, no. I'm Bad so sorry. Times. Oh. Ah. Baited out the jump in. I did. I did. Well done. Honks. One of the lessons that I think I've definitely Round learned two. by playing DBZ Point. is just, like, you got meter, you know? Mm. I used to be, or I probably still continue to be someone who, like, holds on to meter far longer than I should. I would agree with that statement. Uh, in DBZ, I'm a, a waster. Sure. I will, like, our boy J.M. Crofts, one of the tips he gave out was uh, that, you know, you should only use meter when you're about to kill your opponent. Okay. That and makes that, sense. That was something that he said that I'm like, what? But I use meter just to get around. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> I can't be using... I can't save my meter like that, but... Right. You know, I think, uh... It's, if you have a... A 40% damage combo or something lined up, I think meter's still gonna be fine. That makes sense, yeah. But, like, at the same time... I don't know when to hold them, when to hold them. Right. No one to walk away. No when to run. And no when to slide. Oh my I God. thought I jumped. I thought I jumped. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's one frame or something, so it's like beats most anything. 
Oh my god. Oh, so I should have. I sh God, I should have been way more careful. We were talking. All That's right. true. All right, let's talk more rock and roll. <laughs> Well done. It was well good, done. Very I tried fun. to go for the like to like do the psycho grab, mm. but like <laughs> I should have known better than to like hang out in the corner with a grappler. <laughs> like, I suppose <laughs> that situation favors the grappler just a smidge more. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Uh, well, we'll see you in the next game. That was in fun. The next game. Hell yeah. Which I reckon is injustice. That's correct, sir. Injustice two, to be specific. Yes. We're not going back to play Injustice 1. No. So Probably don't turn not that ever dial. again. <laughs> also true. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, maybe to see, like, Deathstroke, just to yeah. pop in and say hello. And Lex Luthor. Yeah, I Lex miss. Luthor and Death Deathstroke. That's, like, mm -hmm. the really only two people that I miss, personally. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But, I... yeah. We digress. See you in the next game. We're back. We're ready. We're... It's time to fight again. Oh, boy. I think he knew who was coming out. Yeah. I mean, I... Boy, I wasn't... Sh I'm not sure. Like... I think... Cheetah. It's time for our pal Cyborg. Cyborg. All right. This is a fight we've had many times. Yeah. I feel a lot more confident in the matchup between oh. Cyborg and Cheetah. We gotta do this Oh, thing. yes, we very much do. Come on. Hit the B button. Or... Here. What am I there doing? We go. Let's try this. This is a good start. Oh, I had to do that first. I had to like set it to the center and press match options too. Forgot all about that. Ah, sure. That is a good sign. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I don't know about you, but I haven't played much Injustice lately. No, the only time I played Injustice too much lately was for uh, when the Turtles came out. Right. We played for like an hour and a half or something, and then mm -hmm. before then, we streamed something. Yeah, I think just, you know, some Regular casual plan. And like, the thing with like, Injustice, or like, basically any Netherrealm game, you know, with the way the dial combos are put together, you know, it's just like, the rust is just so much more free, like easy oh, to see. Sure. Like, which is apparent right now. Oof. I was like, are you sure you want Cyborg full screen? <laughs> but then you were fine about it. <laughs> you put down that taxidermy. <laughs> there you go. I was like, it's a water buffalo. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh boy, I didn't I didn't want to like try to guess in the moment what animal that was exactly, because I'm like, well, people are gonna be like, well, he's no zoologist, so that's for damn sure. I, I could be wrong, because that's a water buffalo fighting that elephant, and that's got a different Form shape, right? Yeah. So I think now I'm a, starting to wonder. Right. Myself. I think it's an antelope. Okay. Anyway. Yeah. This is not a zoological exercise. <laughs> this is a the fight. only animal you need to care about is the mighty cheetah. I get it. And I'm not doing super well <laughs> in that regard either. Oh, but you remembered the block strings. I right? did. Like. That's one of the most difficult block strings that I've ever had to encounter in this game. It's it's yeah, a toughie. Nice. Yeah. Oh no. The momentum shift. Stop it, momentum. <laughs> I got I, I did R1 R2 oh, my, my oh, X-ray. Sorry. <laughs> the rust is showing. <laughs> yeah, it's a I should clean my car more. 
we live in a harsh wintry climate <laughs> and we don't get to wash yeah. our cars as often as we'd like it's true it's a little bit of real talk and the salts on the you know i it's real interesting the salt in the winter lands mm. such as ours shows up on the bottom of or the rust shows up on the bottom of cars yes around here but if you live by the coast it's you got the seawater evaporating into the air so you get rusty rooftops that's cool i never yeah. thought about that hey. People were being like, these guys are no zoologists. <laughs> like, damn it, they know a thing about rust. <laughs> One thing. <laughs> All right. Roomba, go! In one of the recent patches, they made a thing for Cyborg where um, the air Roomba also does knockdown, which is oh. pretty great. I really haven't been able to try it, though. Air Roomba. Like... People could call it a drone, but it's like, let's be real. It's all, they're all Roombas. There's no Roomba for debate here. That's true. Is that an Impala? Or a, a Ziga Antelope? I don't know. <laughs> oh, man. The challenge. Hmm. She is the Vegeta of this game. Because I main her. <laughs> and for that reason alone. <laughs> uh, fair. <laughs> Very fair. <laughs> but uh, with the comment like that, you know. Right. I relish the challenge. I suppose that's something more Goku would say. That's true. Maybe she's more the Android 21, because she does eat people. That's true. And she, uh... Spoilies. <laughs> Come on, are you fucking with me right now? <laughs> I think you are. I'm I gonna am. have to assume. De Most definitely. Oh, man. Oh. Okay. Don't lose your shit. Ooh! That weird, that weird walk animation. <laughs> it's a prowl. You know? mm. Oh no. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you sounded pretty happy about that. Oh shit, I forgot about the, uh... Yep. Uh, That's my robo spine. <laughs> Oof. Mm -hmm. This has been good so far. It's gone to three, like, each time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm screwed. As you should be. That's, okay. I feel good about the uh, the clash that I did. It's a a good clash. Which I feel is like, like I was too busy thinking about Android 21 to even notice mm, it. Mm, I mean, yes, don't get me wrong, yes. <laughs> but I should be thinking more about cyborgs and androids. Yes, you really should. There's a key difference between the two. Just so you know. One shoots key blasts. One takes a key to operate. That's right, cyborg. I know your secret. <laughs> the ignition port. <laughs> All right. Oh. Cross-ups for days. Yeah, Did I ever tell you yeah. that's how it's done in Motown? Sonic Boom! I miss the days when I mained Guile. Me too, honestly. Just... <laughs> I like Guile as a character way more than M. Bison. Mm -hmm. Let's be real. M. Bison's a nerd. So is Geek, but I love him. True. Yeah. It's your turn to be the, the nerds in these games can be a lot of fun. That's true. Oh boy. Oh boy. 
better call an audible. Your blood will stain my claws. It's like she almost kind of sounds like that might be an inconvenience. Like, it'll stain my claws. Dude. Let's just call this whole thing up right now. Oh, nice, Roomba. Oh, I tried to, <laughs> to mm. can't uh, combo break that. Yeah. Projectiles. Mm. Good job. Yes, good set. Which means now we go to the third game, which we would have done anyway, but... Right, right. The so, stakes are high. Very. So, one to one... With a final game, mm -hmm. this is your right. And each like each of these went to its third match too, so it's just mm -hmm. like get ready to get disappointed in DBZ. <laughs> I know, I really <laughs> am. <laughs> Jeff has been playing DBZ a lot more than I have. He's it's true. I've he's been... putting in the time. Yeah, and I you know I thought this would happen, but I thought you would have taken Street Fighter and I would have taken Injustice. You know, I kind of did too, but it's just like the Bison and Geef matchup can yeah. go like just it can really go anywhere mm -hmm. we've had those times where it's just like where bison has won handily and also where geef has mm -hmm. won handily it's just like both are very like steamrolly kind of characters right so it's like it becomes like an uphill battle for the right. other guy and you know it's we use them to tr to so-called train against each other you right know? so it's sort of like they're at the same level yeah much. very much so I, but now, again, Jason's been playing a little more Street Fighter. I misplaced my copy of Street Fighter, oh, as I'm we so know. Sad. I think I, it's either time to buy another copy or, you know, actually look through all the boxes in my right. grandma's garage. Now, see, had you. Would I pay $20 to avoid an inconvenience? Yes. Anyway. <laughs> well, that's a good point, though. Like, if you bought. Like, you could probably could just buy a copy. One, yeah. yeah, you could buy a copy of, like,. Street Arcade Fighter edition, even yeah, because you've got the you've well, yeah. got the downloads for I it. I have the first two seasons, right? But um, if that I'm... honestly might be because I mean, think about how cheap a, like a copy of Street Fighter One is going to be. I actually did ask a guy at GameStop, oh, if, nice. uh, but he said they were sold out. Weird. <laughs> Maybe for the same reason. Anyway, that see you be... in DB. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's the final game. Yeah, we're back, and we just wanted to give a special shout out to Krillin Yusuf. <laughs> <laughs> Such a good oh, name, man. Oh, my current name on this is Dill Piccolo. That's a really good it's, one. No, not as good as Krillin Yusuf. That say. is a really good one. And uh, it was all because I saw some guy named Bardock Obama. <laughs> I'm like, oh my god, <laughs> I gotta get a pun name up in here. Yeah, exactly. And there was no room for eat your vegetables. Oh, uh, you know? what was the third one? Uh, dirt, like Napa. dirt Napa. Like yeah, something like that. Dirt Napa. I need to come up with a pun for mine too. Uh, All right. Nothing wrong with the yam chumps. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's yeah, very true. All right. Oh, let me think. It's a bad sign if you don't know your team. Well, see, like I'm just thinking, like I've had, you know, when we were playing earlier, I had such good results with Frieza, mm -hmm. and like I really want to work on my Frieza more. But you're right. For the sake of this showdown, I gotta use the team that has been, like, getting me the most results. Nice choice. Guess I'm gonna have to show you I'm not playing around. Guess who? Yep, so, it's Tien, Majin Buu, and Yamcha versus Piccolo, Vegeta, and Nappa. That's the... That's where it's at. Yeah, that really is where it's at. Now, where will it be at is another question. We can't go to, like... Land of the Kai's. What about the or, Cell Games Arena? Uh, that sounds good. Let's do that. That's probably my favorite level. Why is that, Jason? I like... I like the, um... Well, I just like the way the Cell Games Arena looks. You got those four spires mm. in there, and, like, I like the nice tile work thing for the arena itself. I don't know. I think it's a cool level. I like that over the tournament thing, you know, just the world tournament stage. I don't know. I like it. And it's just one of the things that I loved about Cell. He achieved his perfect form and decided to hold a tournament to showcase it. Yeah, it's just I do like so... that he like made it himself, right? He yeah. Just, like, shot the ground. 
Just if I remember correctly. Like classic martial art villain sort of <laughs> things. And I approve yeah. of that. You know? I do like that it becomes the wasteland with a giant crater if you blow it up. That's right. That's like very classic for That's the show. That's super cool. That's my favorite part about this stage. But... Alright. Good luck for this final fight. Yes, good luck, Chase Space. <laughs> So I have a, I don't know if it's a bad habit, but it's just a habit that I have in the game where it's like Yamcha is like my definitive anchor in the game. And oh. like, I like the match always seems to end with like Yamcha with a whole bunch of meter and spark, and just like, like I guess, like even though it oftentimes like it works, you know, like I'll I'll get the win out of it sometimes, but like I want to try and prevent it from becoming like the only thing I do. Sure. Um, first I would say that there's no harm in having an anchor. Nap is my anchor. I right. guess I would just say don't save up till you have six bars or whatever. Yeah, that's a thing that I'm really trying to do. Or not do. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. Very close. Like, yeah, the timing if, like, I can see the fact that I was almost going to be able to get through out of there. I would have brought in as many <laughs> special as <laughs> needed, though. Thankfully, I had three bars there. Alright. Speaking of bringing people in, oh, that was not what I wanted, but, you know, life happened. Ooh, man. Would you say that Nappa is your Zangief in this game? <laughs> we really haven't had the we even had the top opportunity to talk about that. <laughs> but like we just played Street Fighter. <laughs> sure. Like what's your fighting game type is presenting itself? <laughs> <laughs> I do like I like to be human. <laughs> no, um I you know Power I'm, characters, yeah? Yeah, I do, sure. Uh the, oh, man, good face. Uh, I would say that uh, a couple of things about Nappa drew me to Nappa. Um, when the ver first thing was that you said that he was like my best character, yes. and I was like, I, he was just one of like ten people I was trying that day. You know what I mean? Sure. And I'm like, oh, maybe, you know, I gotta think about it a little more, you know? Oh, that's fantastic. Thank you. And, uh, some, I love a couple of his moves. Like, I love, he's got my favorite projectile where he just blows up an area of the map. Um, and I really like that air grab. And he, I love counters in games. Like, sure. that's why I play, like, Akuma or Ryu in Street Fighter. Okay. And, um,. He's got one of those counter moves. Like Piccolo has a couple of them. Oh God, that's and, uh, like it's so tough to deal with your Piccolo, dude. <laughs> I've tried to grab, like you know, sure. charge. You would have beat me up anyway. Uh, I just need to make Piccolo more dead. I feel like, sure. I feel like I've, I'm getting the tactics of his neutral down a little bit, okay. but I haven't like come up with any kind of. Oh, you text that in here. Nice. Mm. Hold on. Good match. If you want to blame something, blame your own fate. That's yeah. I and yeah. Uh, I, I certainly hope you're not looking down on the great Yamcha. <laughs> <laughs> uh, damn that Yamcha. Yeah. <laughs> Always. Short. Show me what you yeah. Got. Like, Yamcha, definitely, I feel like he's my best in this game. Oh, definitely. Like, he's, he just gets the results for me. Mm-hmm. 
What I've had to accept about Piccolo is that, like, I've been treating him like he's a, a defensive character, but I feel like he's a lot more dangerous when the momentum's on his side. Oh, that's... I can definitely... <laughs> Agree with yeah, that, yeah, for sure. And then there's Vegeta. It, he's like he's got that uh, the best assist in the game according to the pros. True. And uh, it is a good one. I like that. Yeah. It's nice. It's a good the appeals to your demographic. Mm -hmm. The funny thing is, the first team I played as had Piccolo Vegeta on it, and then I was... Ah, oh, nice. I was really... Not one. But it happens. Uh, I had Trunks instead of Nappa yep. in it, but Trunks takes a little more practice. Trunks you know. is tough. He's not... He's not the worst at that, but he's got some weird moves that yeah, he's got to learn to Nice. I was really trying to get TN out of there, but <laughs> we know that's coming out. Excuse me, it's a beer coming to the surface. <laughs> Full disclosure, we have partaken in alcoholic <laughs> beverage. <laughs> We apologize to our prohibitionists. <laughs> Prohibitionists. <laughs> Prohibitionists. Yeah. Yes. What is language? It's uh, it's probably the great single greatest thing that unites us as a like <laughs> as a human species. I don't know. At, at least that's kind of how I've always interpreted it. It's Nappa. It's a new disaster. Haha! My boy! What have you done to my boy? Oh boy. Oh boy! Wow! They both have the burst damage and not like the right. over time. So and that, that really, like, really counteracts the spark, yeah. for sure. Oh, literally. Ooh. Ooh. That's it. Mm -hmm. That is all she wrote. Good job. I mean, Very I, good job. I love these, uh, these little end of the month challenges, man. I do too. I'm really enjoying them. I agree. So, I mean, my one to your two, well done. Made a very good job. Uh, DBZ was definitely... I didn't have hopes on DBZ. I kind of figured you were going to take it. I, You know, I don't know. Uh, I've Put, been putting in the time. You know, exactly. Sure. It definitely watching, shows. I've been watching a lot of videos. Mm -hmm. uh, I've been watching myself wait for another match in the practice room <laughs> right. for 15 minutes at a time or whatever. Sure, sure. So uh, that's maybe that was the trick, you know, Bandai, Namco, or whatever. They they made it so that matches took forever to find. They're like, well, then they'll go into the practice room and then they'll end up getting better and then they'll like the game more wow and, you know it's all this the long con the conspiracy 9-11 was an inside <laughs> shot <laughs> <laughs> are you saying bandai namco is planted? uh am i following your reasoning uh, correctly? something like that okay i saw a motherfucker who had that as their bumper sticker oh yeah like, and they also had something community school I'm like, oh, these people have children you know <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Man, bumper stickers. They are the weirdest thing. Like, I don't get them. I just don't. Like, you know, you have so many avenues to, like, talk about your opinions that you have to make your car a billboard, <laughs> basically. Like, do you have do you have things to say that are that important? Like, if I was going to have a bumper sticker 
It would basically just be a picture of Skeletor. That's all. A simple, elegant Skeletor bumper sticker. Yeah, you know, I was That's just all you about need. to say, it's like either you have an idea you desperately need to share, mm -hmm. or you're proud of something. Yes. And I guess, you know, you're proud of your love of Skeletor. <laughs> Maybe it's just something you really enjoy, and those are like True. some of the rarer ones. Right. Um, like I, I have a tiny sticker of Castle Danger on my right. car. A local brewery that a friend of ours works at. Yeah, yeah. So, uh... But, like, if you, I, like, it's kind of like that one thing where with the 9-11 was an inside job. If you honestly believe that, you'd be like, I have to tell as many people as possible. <laughs> right. But, uh, yeah, that's about my only logic I can put behind that, I guess. I respect that. <laughs> All right, Chase. Thanks for playing. We'll yes, see you next time. Yes, of course. Next month, yeah. I'll... Over the month of March, I'm going to be playing DBZ exclusively because I got to match, you know, the training that Jeff has been doing. And also our buddy Sean, who mm -hmm. we play DBZ with, it seems to be almost on a nightly basis now. Like, yeah. it's been fairly regular. So I'm going to be practicing DBZ pro almost exclusively for the next month. And so... Should be fun. Yeah, the end of the month showdown for March is probably going to have a much more intense DBZ I sure thing so. we did. Not so. that that wasn't fun. I'm, you know... I, it was I a good match. Characters. Look, Nap is all bruised and shit. That's true. Yeah, he's been through the ringer. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, it's Nappa versus Yamcha. Historically, that hasn't worked <laughs> out well for yeah. our poor boy. Mm -hmm. Look to the cannon, my child. <laughs> all, all right, right. gang. Have a wonderful rest of your week, and we'll see you next time.